Uh, last evening, Jesse and I were relaxing at the house, thought we might want a cocktail. So I went to my liquor cabinet and I picked up some bourbon whiskey. When I looked at it, it said it's 48% alcohol and I decided that was just a bit stronger than I'd like. And the scientist in me said, well, what can I do about this? So I looked into it and researched it and got a little bit of equipment. I sent away to Mountain Home Biological and I picked up an alcohol hydrometer set. It comes with a little floating hydrometer and also a special hydrometer tube. And they claim that this tube is a lot smaller than a normal graduated cylinder so that you don't have to use as much of the sample to get your reading. Well, then I found out that alcohol readings vary with temperature. So the first thing we need to do is to measure the temperature of the alcohol that we're going to be testing. This temperature is 26 degrees. So if I have 26 degree alcohol, then I go to the proof hydrometer temperature correction table that came with my alcohol hydrometer from Mountain Home Biological. And then I can look at the, the hydrometer is rated at 20 degrees Celsius and I'm reading actually 26 degrees. So how do I convert that? I go to this handy table. I go to 26 degrees and I look at what should this be reading if it's 48% and it should be reading at about 50%. So let's test that out. I take the hydrometer, I insert it in, let it float until it comes to a stop. And it's actually reading 50% alcohol. So again, if I'm testing an alcohol, 50% on the hydrometer, it's 26 degrees Celsius. So I look at the table, I find 26 degrees Celsius, and I go down to 50%. Actually, I go down to, uh, I find 50% here at 26 degrees, and it should be reading 48, and it's reading 48. All right, so we have established that this company measured their alcohol well, and it's actually 48% alcohol. The problem here is I only want 40% alcohol in my cocktail. Jesse doesn't like a stronger alcohol either. So what we're going to do is we're going to figure out how do we make a 40% alcohol from a 48% alcohol start. And there's a formula we use for that. The formula goes like this, volume times percent alcohol divided by desire percent alcohol equals or actually minus volume equals water required. All right, so we take volume times the percentage of alcohol, which we figured out is 48%, divided by the desired percentage of alcohol, which is 40%, minus the volume equals the water required to make the new mixture. So let's, uh, let's figure we're going to use
Let's make a hundred milliliters. So we're starting with a hundred milliliters. times 48 is the percentage of the alcohol divided by 40, that's what we'd like to have, minus 100 equals the amount of water required. Okay, so let's do this on the calculator. 48 divided by 40 equals 1.2 times 100. 100 times 1.2 equals 120 minus 100 equals 20. Okay, so in our 100 milliliters of alcohol at 48%, we need to add 20 milliliters of water to create a 40% alcohol. So, if I add milliliters okay so now let's test and see if we're actually where we want to be okay put the hydrometer in One side reads percent, and one side reads proof. 200 percent, I mean 200 proof, is 100 percent alcohol. Okay, so what I'm reading here is this reads 42. Remember, it's 26 degrees Celsius, so I need to go to the chart. 26, if it's reading 42, it's actually 40%. Wait a minute, 42? It's actually 40%. So, we effectively turned 48% alcohol into 40% alcohol. And that is my presentation. Thank you.